Have you wanted to put together a movie night where the dinner, drinks, and snacks are all themed with the movie that you're watching? I'm sure you've seen those posts and videos where people inspire you to want to create your own movie night theme party, but maybe leave you feeling a little overwhelmed, unsure where to start, and maybe even wondering where people have the time or the money to spend on all this. Today, I'm gonna to share with you my strategy on how I come up with my movie theme night tips on how to create your movie to start when you have absolutely no clue where to start. So let's get into it. Hey everybody, it's Bethany here. Welcome to my channel. And today I'm bringing you Mommy's Movie Magic, my brand new channel that's going to walk you through step-by-step -step on how to create movie night magic in your own home to create movie theme nights that your family and loved ones will remember. Today, I'm just gonna share with you my strategy and my tips on how to recreate your own movie night in your own home. Make sure you stay tuned till the end of this video where I'm going to let you know what my very first movie night is gonna be with all of you next week and I'm so excited to reveal it. It's one of my favorite movies from when I was a little kid and I'm so excited to recreate the magic with you for next week. Let's get started. Okay, so my first tip is to plan ahead. I know that probably goes without saying that anything worth doing is going to take a little bit of planning. You need time to decide what you're gonna have for dinner, for dessert, for snacks and you need time to kind of plan that out and go grocery shopping. You need time to get decorations, or if you're doing anything extra, you need time to plan for all that. So my tip for you is to plan ahead. Are you gonna have those nights where you're gonna throw it together last minute because let's say you watch the video and you go, oh, I have that because it's just a box of mac and cheese and some hot dogs in my refrigerator. And I have all that stuff, so we're gonna throw our movie night together. Absolutely, but are those gonna be few and far between? Yes. Suggestion number two is to pick your movie. Now, I know what you're thinking. Bethany, obviously if I'm having a movie night, I already have my movie in mind that I want to watch. But it's a little bit more than that. Yes, you have a movie that you wanna watch, but think about a little bit deeper. The movie is about something particular. Say it's set in China, but maybe your family doesn't eat Chinese food. That probably not, is not the best theme to go because you're not gonna find food that goes along with that movie. So just keep that in mind when you're selecting the movie that you want to encompass food and drink around with it. Step number three is to plan your menu. Now, my suggestion for this is I have three different things I look at when I'm starting to look at my, my, my menu. The very first thing I look at is the movie itself and if it revolves around any particular food in the movie. For example, Snow White. The poison apple plays a big part in that, so we make poison apples to go along with our movie. Um, ratatouille is ratatouille. Those are easy, simple things that you can pull that come right from the movie itself. The second thing I look at, that if the movie doesn't revolve around a certain type of food, then I look at where the movie is set. Is it set in France? Is it set in England? And look at those type of foods that can pull from the country or the culture that you're coming from, and that might be a little bit easier for you to find a food that matches with where you're from. And thirdly, I look at the movie itself to see if I can pull something from it. Is there a symbol or a star or something particular that stands out in the movie or the characters that you can put on a cookie or make the food look like? And it just makes it that much more magical to pull from the movie and incorporate it into your food. So once you kind of narrow all that down, you have to decide too if you're going to have one or all of the items. Are you just gonna do snacks? Are you just gonna make special cocktails for your night? Any of all those things you have to take into consideration. My fourth piece of advice is decide if you are doing any extras. Extras are things like decorating and doing crafts. So if you're decorating, there's something that you need to plan out. Are you going to the party store and buying a bunch of stuff? Are you gonna make things? Are you gonna look into um, anything you can find online to go with it? All that stuff is time consuming and, eats, and takes up a lot of money. So is that really going to bring value to your movie night? If the answer is yes, you need time to plan that. If no, stick with just the food. The other one is crafts. If you're planning to do a craft, that could be a great thing to entertain the kids while you're cooking. You could get them involved in helping you with something and make that part of your dinner. For example, plan a dessert where the kids can help you decorate it or something that you can do in advance that's going to be a centerpiece of your, of your movie night for the dinner table. All those things can be ideas that you can play with when you are planning your movie night. My fifth tip for you is to make it fun and don't stress about it. 
That's why I am here to help you plan these movie nights and to make them more fun. They're not supposed to be stressful. It is all about you, your family, and what you guys are going to enjoy and not something that you're trying to aspire to this certain look or what someone else did because you need to make it your own and what's gonna benefit you and your family and what you are going to enjoy, not what someone else is going to enjoy. So that's why I'm here. And I told you at the beginning of this video that I would let you know what my very first movie night I'm gonna start with, and it is Little Mermaid. So stay tuned till next week when you get to see exactly how you can create easy, affordable, fun movie nights that your family can enjoy. Hit that subscribe button down below. Turn on notifications so you don't miss my first movie night coming out next week.